Auntie It's the most beautiful time of the day. We're making coffee. I don't know how to put my camera so I have a good angle, but yeah, you kind of get the idea. This is my new robe that I got for Christmas. I mean, <gasps> coffee's brewing. That first sip feeling, it's good. I don't know if I should tell you this, but we have this little froth machine from Nespresso and my mom and dad, they drink regular milk and they did not clean it properly. Actually, they didn't clean it at all. It was just kind of like drying there. And I like pressure washed it with like water. And then I look into the, I look into the bottom of the machine and there are still crusty milk down there. And I swear to God, I almost threw up like right now. My eyes are tearing up, it's so disgusting. I was gagging, um, <laughs> ew. We have a big day today. Wait, I'm gonna get my to-do list. I need to go get my contacts because I'm sick of wearing those glasses and otherwise I can't see you and you look cute. Okay. I need to go get my mugs at a uh, ceramic cafe. I also need to go to the post office and I have been invited by Holt Renfrew to go shopping and I have my eye on a bag. But the thing is, I watched someone's story last night and they were saying like, oh, uh, I have a Chanel and it's amazing because like the value does appreciates most likely and you like it's an investment piece and the bag I want to buy is really not an investment piece but I don't know it speaks to me so obviously going to Holt Warren for the main event today I'm really excited and I'm also going to my cottage tomorrow so we need to pack my cottage is in New Brunswick and it's a 10 hour drive so I'm gonna get a makeup on and honestly we're gonna leave pretty pretty soon so makeup is did I used pink eyeshadow and I did a little pink lip and now we're gonna pick an outfit and you know i'm gonna film a tiktok there's too much pink on my eye i don't like it anymore this is an outfit this <gasps> whoa <laughs> sorry <laughs> and we're leaving first stop is going to get my contacts and gab needs to stop to the garage for some reason we got all the goodies for the eyes literally so snappy today like i am so impatient and annoyed at everything like there's snow it pisses me off the fuck everything pisses me off so uh we're gonna put some contacts and hopefully it'll make us all feel better you see just the fact that my bag is falling mm. oh my god nice for anyone who's debating if they should get contacts or not i got mine like this year and honestly it was so long overdue i can wear sunglasses and that was so boring like okay i'm gonna put this on sit back and relax and we're going to Holt Renfrew next. We're here, we're just walking to the store, and I'm excited to go shopping. Guys, this is the bag that I want. I saw it last time, and I just fucking love it. I'm gonna try it on and see if they have a new one in the back. I put the bag on hold for now, cause I'm not sure, and it has a little defect, so I have a 10% off, which is kind of nice, but it's also kind of a defect. So I picked up these Acne Studios pants, this acne scarf, and this, I don't know what's the brand of the Samso Samso sweater. And I think it's gonna look cute all together. Pants are too big. We are back home and we're gonna do a little unboxing. I bought the bag. It's so gorgeous. It's gorgeous. Look at this. And I know I'm gonna want to wear it more like a crossbody bag because I'm just into crossbody lately. <laughs> I feel like this is me. Like I could not go buy a black bag. Like who am I kidding? And I also got um, this sweater. It fits really cute and I feel like it's going to be a good piece. Now I have to pack. I also had a little crisis. I don't know, my, my emotions were all over the place today, so I had to take a break. Now it's three in the afternoon, so I need to get back on my shit. I'm gonna do my return in New Brunswick. So I had to pick up my mugs, I forgot. I thought it's gonna be when I'm coming back. Hopefully they don't throw them out. I don't wanna pack, so I'm eating a cookie, watching the last episode of Emily in Paris, and we'll resume later. It's now 7 p.m. I believe. It's fucking late. I did not pack. I poured myself a glass of wine to make it more fun. So I'll show you my process and we'll try 
and make it work. Put my luggage on the bed, a glass of wine. I really don't have a method if I'm being completely honest. I just put my, my suitcase on the bed and then um, I start my underwear because that's the easiest pajamas. And then when it comes to pack clothes, it's harder now that I do content and stuff because I have to plan everything accordingly. And we're driving tomorrow, but I'm coming back by plane, so I have to make sure everything fits in my suitcase. This is where we're at right now. I took the pants here, so I'm bringing white, knit beige, navy, gray, and black. My dog is scared that I'm leaving. My underwear, I have my sweaters. I'm debating bringing this one because it's way too chunky, so it might just take too much room. Um, I'm bringing loads of workout stuff because I hope it will motivate me to work out. Look, I don't even know if it's going to close and I don't have boots or jackets in here. So I'm going to bring a second luggage probably with all of that. And here's my carry-on. Well, that's just my fun bag. So I have like board games, cookbook, I have a puzzle. I had dinner with my family. It was so good. We had Rockefeller oysters, which I took a picture of. Oh my god! I had some risotto. It was good. This one is closed and ready to go. It was just unrealistic to have only one suitcase. This half is already loaded up with coats and furry jackets and stuff. And now we're gonna add all the boots in here and hopefully a few more uh, sweaters. I didn't think I wanted to bring Trumpet, but she's coming. Uh, but this is pretty much what we have going on. I think that's it for tonight, guys. I'm just gonna go to bed. We're getting up really, really early tomorrow. So we're waking up at like four and a half, five. So I'm gonna go to bed. But I love you and we'll see you tomorrow. We're leaving, guys. See you in the car. Oh, packing the essentials, I guess. Hi, guys. I just woke up from a nap. Everybody's gone out to pee and I'm here not peeing. Oh, we're three hours in. Let's go. We're here. I'll give you guys a little tiny tour, but we're still unpacking, so it's kind of messy. This is the living room. It's gorgeous. Dining area, little sunroom situation, and all around you have the beautiful view of the ocean. And this is where my parents are from, and we come here every year, but this cottage is new. We got it this year. And this is my room. I unpacked everything, so I have all my clothes here. I packed shoes this is tops I have the bottoms hats accessories scarf bag sunglasses jackets we're only staying a week but i'm always really really motivated and kind of inspired when i'm here so i always bring a lot of stuff to create we're gonna pretty much take it easy right now it's 3 p.m i'm really excited to start my puzzle this is what we're doing look how cute i'm so excited mommy what's going on i'm excited to be home me too. Oh. Cheers, baby. Good morning, guys. I just woke up. I had a very, very good night of sleep. This is the view this morning. Right now, I am making a coffee. Well, I will go be making myself a coffee. I have a meeting with my manager, Lana. And my grandparents are coming over today, so I'm really excited. Okay. Chocolate milk! I'm taking my meeting in my bed because I have the loudest family in all of America. So I need to isolate. So... To a good meeting and a good day. Tasty. Hello? Hi. Oh wow, my internet does not work. <laughs> Hi. You can't hear me? Hey, weird, my headphones are not working. Still? My mic was off. <laughs> Oops. Okay, bye bye the vlog.